welcome to the channel viewers and subscribers today guys i'm going to show you how to remove and replace your suzuki swift air condition compressor coil the first thing you're going to do guys is use your 10 millimeter socket and pull these four bolts Guys, I'm going to use my Phillips and pull the side bumper screw. So I pull the right side already, guys. Now I'm going to pull the left side left side pull now we're just going to lift the spot on the bumper guys so what i'm really trying to achieve here guys is to just remove the bumper so i can remove this bracket here Pull this clip. So, guys, now the compressor is right in front of me. So I can easily pull the high side and low side pipe and pull the three bolts that hold the compressor on the engine. Before I remove the high side and low side pipe, I'm going to um, recover the refrigerant out of the system. As you see, the system is full of refrigerant I have to recover it first before I pull the low side and high side pipe. I'm going to use my treats, 10 millimeter socket. now guys i have on my three hits 12 millimeter socket with my electric ratchet kanga make it that easier
Easy as one, two, three, guys. Now we're going to remove the compressor coil. First thing we're going to remove, guys, is the clutch here. So we're going to pull this plug bolt to remove the clutch. Then we're going to remove the pulley wheel. And the coil is right behind the pulley wheel. So guys, when you turn on the AC, inside current go to the coil. The coil re-energize and lock the clutch here on the pulley wheel so it lock it like this and when the belt turn in the pulley wheel inside the internal part it the compressor started to create a vacuum and a discharge and that's how the compressor work sorry guys it's not a 12 millimeter socket pull the clutch face is a 14 socket I know some technician might be saying why you don't just um, pull the three 12 bolts and hang it down on the vehicle and try to remove the, the coil but sometimes guys you can do that but you see when you have difficult situation like this when I have to put two screwdriver at the side here to brace off the, the clutch and try my best to prevent it from bend Trust me, it can be difficult on the vehicle, so it's always best to remove the compressor so you can maneuver it properly. So here is the clutch, guys. And now I'm going to remove the pulley wheel. There's a clip, guys, that you have to remove so, you, so I can take off the the pulley wheel that is it so here, guys here are the kyle here Guys, we rewrap the compressor coil. You can see the wire installation inside the coil here. So we're going to fit it on the compressor now. Compressor coil on. It's time now to install the compressor pulley wheel compressor, compressor pulley wheel on time now to um, replace the clip I'm going to install a clutch face now We are ready to go now guys, time to reinstall the compressor on the vehicle but before that 
I'm going to add some 134A oil to the compressor. Testing the compressor, guys. You hear that? Guys, this is a stretch belt. This um, vehicle don't bring tension or pulley wheel or self adjustment um, pulley. So after right now, actually going to jump this belt right now. Start. That's it now guys, the belt is on the compressor. So now I'm going to reinstall the low side and high side pipe. Um, tighten up the high side and low side pipe on the compressor. Now we are going to pressure test the system, and once there's no leak on the system, then we are going to vacuum and recharge. Finish vacuum, and now we are going to recharge the system. So we are going to make sure that everything is okay before we fit up now I'm going to start the engine and turn on the AC Recharging the system with some 134A refrigerant. Now, guys, as you see, I finished put up the bumper on the vehicle and I also fully recharge the air condition system. Look at the low side pipe, guys, getting a lot of water. And now, inside the vehicle, blowing coal. Another successful job from Curb School Year Auto. Please guys like and share this video and if you're new on the channel, please subscribe.